Um, um, yeah. Remember that um community post about almost forty eight, you know, maybe a, a day ago, maybe twenty four hours ago, maybe not forty eight hours, maybe twenty four hours ago. I forgot what time I posted. Yeah, you remember that the community post saying that uh about the whole Drake and um Kendrick this whole beef going on. Well, I said I wasn't gonna engage into it until I went to my uh sister and her fiance's house uh last night and um they was playing every diss song between the two and um 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 uh uh, uh Drake this is what I'm gonna need you to do. Drake I'm gonna need you to um pack your bags right quick. I need you to get up off Go somewhere. Uh lay low for a minute, man. Just lay low. Don't get on don't get in the booth anymore. Just lay low. And um uh just be gone for like a year or so, a couple of months. Maybe not even a year, but for like a couple of months. Uh somebody at OVO needs to throw you the towel. Somebody needs to be a yes man for once. Not even a yes man. A no man. A no man. Saying, um, j- 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 they just need to take the mic away from you for a minute. Just lay low. Just go away, man. Just go away. Um, j- 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 just go. Just take a second, reestablish yourself, and like in a few months, um, because this is not looking great for you. Um, you right now are looking like Martin. With the episode when he's fighting Time and Hearns. Your face all bruised up. You, your face swollen. Sitting on the couch. Uh, social media is clowning your ass right now. Your your coaches fans. They 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 can't they can't help you no more. Your closest ones, they can't help you no more. Uh what's your team warned you six years ago? Almost six years ago, last month, he gave you a warning shot six years ago. And Kendrick is now putting the eulogy out there. Um, this this ain't about rap no more. This is about you, your whole life. He's putting your whole life out there. Uh, now, I don't know about the allegations of uh, body moving. Are real, but um, some of the stuff he has said, especially in that last disc record, uh, I, I I definitely agree. We can all see it. We can all see the signs of some of your insecurities, and he he put you out there, man. You you just you go on now. You go on the Turks and Caicos on now. Just stay there because this ain't looking good for you, man. This is looking bad for you. No one's coming to save you this time. Old boy down in Houston, he ain't try, he ain't gonna save you this time. Uh uh-uh. uh. No, Kendrick. No, Kendrick. He he took you to therapy. He sat down with everybody in your family, your mama, your daddy, your son that everybody knows about, your daughter that nobody knows about allegedly. He sat down all y'all, even yourself, and gave you therapy. He didn't he didn't rap he didn't rap battle with you. He gave y'all therapy. Like a psychiatrist or something. He laid you off all, all, all y'all in an office. In a chair or one of those uh bed chairs or whatever they call them when you in therapy and talked about your feelings, your problems, your insecurities. He gave your son a stepson, a stepson, stepfather talk. This man is, is is beating you. It's like in a boxing ring almost. You can't land any jabs on. Him. You can't land anything on. Him. This is like Terrence Crawford and Earl Spence last year, not landing the punch. This this, this is worse than Infinity War for you. 
Not only you turn into dust, there's no hope for you to come back alive like in Endgame. There's no get the get the gunlet together and snap resnapping. No, man. No. Mm -mm. And we all know Kendrick admitted to some of his uh, pitfalls in his last album, but uh, you got to address this, my guy, on a serious note. I don't know how, how much of all this is true, but from what I've seen from you as an artist in the last, what are you arrived on the scene, 08, 09, for the last 15, 16, 14 years, man, some of the insecurities that Kendrick talked about we all can see it. Some of us may not be able to see it because some of us are blind to our even our own insecurities, but I see it. I see what he's talking about. J. Cole's, a, J. Cole's smart, man. J. Cole decided to ride a bike. Right now, he probably reading a all the Harry Potter books right now. He probably watching all the Law and Orders. Everyone. SVU. Law and Order LA. Probably watching all the CSIs right now. To stay out of this. He knew. After he made his. Seven, well, it wasn't even seven a minute. After he made his little diss on his own album. And apologized. He knew what time it was. He knew he did, he did not want to step in the ring with Kendrick because it was not it wasn't gonna be pretty. And here you are thinking you going you 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 think you was gonna go on there and make memes like you did with Meek Mill? That's what you thought this was gonna be? You thought she was gonna go out there and make memes and play some radio bop and think she was gonna win a rap no no no. No, this is a real rap beef, a real rap battle. And you losing terribly. This is worse than the 1985. What the 1985 Bears did to the New England Patriots that year in the, the Super Bowl. This, that's worse. This is worse than me. This is worse than what anything LeBron had done to him in the NBA. This is worse than 2018 when he got swept. LeBron happy right now. The summer the heat off him is on you now. Kendra's not going with memes and be bopping all over the place. Talking about possessions and money and trips to Turks and Caicos and uh, um a mafia coast and all this. No, Kendrick is peeling the layers off you like an onion. He's peeling back the mask. You're like Batman right now. And the Joker's exposed. Not even the Joker. Forget the Joker. Hugo Strange or Rachel. Nah, maybe not Rachel Gould. Rachel Gould ain't about, about exposing Bruce Wayne. But he's exposing your identity out there. You no longer can go from being Bruce Wayne to Batman no more. Everybody knows you are Bruce Wayne now, Drake. The Batman persona is gone. Your identity is out there now, allegedly. This is not looking good for you, man. Please, someone throw him the towel. He's starting to look like Apollo Creed out here. And Kendra just sitting there looking like Ivan Drago talking about if he dies, he dies. Where's your somebody? Don't do what Rocky did. This ain't looking good, Drake. I'm sorry. This ain't looking good. I feel bad for him now. We all got our insecurities, all our problems. But And you got Rick Ross coming after you too? Calling you a white boy? <sighs> I don't know what you did, man. But if I was you, I'd just go high for a year. 
Seriously. That's right. That's right. Call for your mama. You done fucked up, man. That don't you? 